Beginning next month, you can turn your radio to national public radio here in Terre Haute. As News 10's John Swanner explains, NPR means more opportunities for Indiana State University students. On Wednesday, Indiana State University and WFYI Public Radio out of Indianapolis announced they formed a partnership. Starting next month, ISU's 89.7 WISU-FM will simulcast WFYI's programming. ISU will also inherit the license from Rolls-Holman's former campus radio station. Sometime this spring we heard that the Rolls-Holman station was probably available, that they were, they were moving online with their broadcasts. And so the idea of uh, partnering with FYI came up. So lifelong learning, cradle to career, is a big part of the mission of uh, WFYI Public Media. And we're very open to student internships, not just on radio or television or multimedia, but all facets of the business. Right in here is our current WISU studio. Uh, it will stay WISU with the public radio. Max Slazuski is WISU's student manager. He says students here are excited to add NPR to their lineup. We are going to be able to bring in more uh, students, be able to recruit uh, in wider areas, uh, more news and public affairs where we haven't really uh, hit on WISU before. 89.7 WISU. This very room has launched many radio and TV careers. Alums from ISU are located in major markets all over the country, but a lot of us cut our teeth right here. Some of us playing jazz and blues in this very control room back in the 80s and 90s. And it's maintaining that legacy, maintaining that music-centered campus radio station that was important to the ISU students of today. That's why the acquisition of that second radio station is so important. This is where our new studio 90.7 WZIS is going to be. It's currently our music library, but there's going to be a big open window, so when you walk down the hallway, you'll be able to see into the studio and see all the students going on air. The next chapter for WISU begins next month, with the debut of WZIS following shortly thereafter. In Terre Haute with photojournalist John Tim, I'm John Swanner, News 10. Indiana State plans to operate WZIS at 7,200 watts. WISU is a 13,500 watt station with a signal that ranges from Greencastle to Effingham, Illinois.